hi guys welcome to my channel so today i'll be showing you how to dye your hair at home this is very easy to achieve your dreadlocks nice and clean at home i'll be using this inecto so this is these are the products that i'll be using So you just mix the two products like that and then you start your um to dye you section the hair and then you dye them one by one especially the ends of the hair because they are the most affected area so yeah guys if you have any questions or you have any suggestions please leave them in the comment section below i'll be happy to reply from you i would like to hear from you if you like the video please like it if you enjoy the video like it comment and subscribe to it i really appreciate your support for all the love that i've been getting i really thank you guys So this is quite easy guys you just especially the affected area you just put um, a dye there then it's gonna it's gonna be black again and my mom is old already so some of the hair are white so we're trying to make them black so yeah guys if you like the video please 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 if you enjoy it give it a like I'll be bringing you more tutorials, more nice videos that you can learn from. So yeah guys, um, that is, that is it because um, after this you leave the hair for 30 minutes maximum, you just leave it after this you leave the hair for 30 minutes so the dye can soak inside the hair and these are the dreadlocks so they must soak very well Make sure all the hair, you dye them and then there were gloves inside that, um, inside their product. So I'm using their plastic gloves. They help me to keep my hands clean. So if you have any questions, don't forget to leave them in the comment section. So I'm tying the hair here in order to keep it for for like 30 minutes and then the 
the dyer doesn't um, make it dirty. So after that, after 30 minutes, we've washed the hair with only shampoo. That is my shampoo. Just wash the hair and then rinse the hair. Make sure you thoroughly squeeze the dye out of the hair. And make sure you, you really rinse it out. Make sure the product is out of the skin. And then finishing it off with a lot of rinsing. I've used at least 10 liter here of water. So after I'm done, I dry the hair. This process takes a bit longer because the, the dreadlocks are quite strong. They are not like normal hair. It can take you like 10 to 15 minutes to dry. Depends the temperature of, of the dry. And as well, just make sure the ends of the dreadlocks are the ones that are more that are more dried because the scalp it dries quicker than the actual dreadlocks so yeah guys i so hope you enjoyed the video and i so hope you are getting my explanations so here we are done drying the hair and then we are tying them my mom she just likes to be neat so just tying the hair and then applying some gel on her edges this is not a dreadlocks um gel but we're just applying it on her edges but it's not ideal for dreadlocks So guys, I so hope you are enjoying the video. I so hope you please, please engage with me on the comment section. I'll be so happy to hear from you.